So we're gonna go over here just in case we missed something. It's a possibility, to be honest, that I missed something over here. Hold on, can I use the elevator? I can summon the elevator now. So where does this go? That's interesting. Oh, snap! Okay, I need my other gun. Don't like this. I'm not much of a sniper. That could have been bad. Hey, there's a Mako here. All patched up. That was an accident. Can I go down there though? Oh snap! All right, heading for the Geth base. <laughs> Let's take it to. Let's do it. Geth base it is. That looks like a wasp. Uh oh. You want some of this? Okay. Say hello to my little friend. Can I run them over? Oh god, I ran right, right into that one. What's up, bruh? Oh god. Ooh, I juked that one nicely. Sick. More chatter, Commander. Still no fix. Any sign of movement? It's only been a few days. I bet you there's gonna be more here in a second. She's my daughter. Right there. I'll wait as long as I have to. Oh! Get out of the way from this rocket. Who's shooting at it? Who's shooting at me? Oh god, I can ran them over. That was a disaster for him. And him. Dunzo. Uh we are at our final destination, which in itself doesn't sound very nice. So this is the Geth base then. Or at least that's where we're going. We've got movement. Some where? Kind of vehicle, not one of the Geth. Sounds like they've spotted us. They must be close. Forget them. We need to find the Geth. Before we do that, I want to see what's down here. This is Oh, these are These are people. That's close enough. Relax, Jong. They're obviously not Geth. Get back, Juliana. Who are you? What do you want? I'm here to help. Commander Shepard. I'm here to remove your Geth problem. You see? You worry too much. And you trust too easily, Juliana. I'm just glad to see a friendly face. I thought we were the only humans left on this planet. Uh, let me see. Well, you're wrong. Because you're not alone. My Dan and some of the members of Zoo's Hope are still alive. I thought you said they were all dead. Uh oh. I said they were probably all dead. They're not dead, but the Geth have really pounded them. We know what that's like. Those damn synthetics are relentless. Where are they, anyways? Are we getting close to their base? <laughs> You're almost there. They're holed up in the Exogeny headquarters, just a bit further down the Skyway. Those headquarters are private property, soldier. Remove the Geth and nothing else. Eh. eh all right, don't worry about it. I'm not interested in your company secrets. Commander, before you go, my daughter, Lisbeth, she's missing. They shouldn't waste time poking around. We could do a proper accounting of our casualties after the Geth are gone. That's messed up. That's my daughter you're talking about. She's still alive. I know it. Oh, uh, well, tell me where she's at and we'll see what we can do. Where is your daughter, Juliana? She was working in the Exogeny building when the attacks came. Oh, yeah, there were several places she could hide. For a short time. I'll find her. If she's in there, I'll get her out. Thank you, Commander. Thank you. What else can we... Ooh, there's a lot of stuff here. So tell me about Zeus Hope. How did you get split up from the Zeus Hope colony? Most of us live closer to the Exogeny building. Zeus Hope was mostly used as a port. When the Geth hit, we scattered. Until you told us about the others, we assumed they were killed in the first wave. If we had known they were still alive, 
We might have attempted to join them. I mean, you still could. I cleared the way. They're fairly secure now. <clears throat> Maybe you should do that. No, 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 no. I don't think that's a good idea. We, we have no vehicles, and the Skyway offers little protection. Like I mean, that's a good point. In now. Listen, our best hope is to sit tight and wait for company reinforcements. They'll come eventually. Okay, then. Uh, Exogeny facility. What was the building used for? Oh, yeah, we repurposed that structure to serve as headquarters for Exogeny. That's mostly offices with a number of uh, light-duty R&D labs. Exogeny is a master at repurposing anything and everything. The company has to make a profit somehow, Juliana. Ferros is a long way from self-sufficient. Especially now. So, we'll get to that last. Uh, tell me about uh, uh, the attack. What was the reason for it? Do you know what the Geth are after? I have no idea. We certainly haven't found anything of use. Something Exogeny is keen to remind us of. We need to recoup our expenses. It's nothing personal. That guy's kind of an ass, but I guess the way he thinks is necessary. But you can tell he's one of the types of people that doesn't get many friends. So, colony information. Tell me about the colony. We established ourselves here four years ago. Growth was steady until the attacks. Our biggest challenge has been the lack of resources. There's just so little here of value. Still, we were making a go of it. It was even starting to feel like home. So then why did you come? What brought you here? I guess I thought this would be the start of a new life. I wanted to go where I could feel like I was making a difference. Instead, everything we built is destroyed. It's very hard not to lose hope. Uh, that makes sense. Well, tell me about uh, Elizabeth's location. I keep wanting to say Elizabeth. Where is your daughter, Juliana? Somewhere at the Exogeny headquarters, I hope. Okay, well then stay put until I get back. Stay bunkered down until I find out what the Geth are after. Of is there anybody else I can talk to? Remember, if you see my daughter... Okay, you didn't finish the sentence, but okay, sure, why not? That's it, everyone else is just security. Oh, who's this? I was hoping you'd have a moment to speak with me. I've got a bit of a problem. Yeah, of course, what's up? What do you need? I need to retrieve some data. It's not a big job, but it pays well. Go on. I'm listening. Good, good. Poking around in the ruins has become a bit too dangerous for me. Deadly for him, fine for us. What could be better? It's not that bad, really. All you need to do is find my console at Exogeny headquarters and drop the data onto this OSD. It's that simple. Huh. I mean, I might be able to help. I'll look around if I get the chance. Oh, well, never I mind. I appreciate it. That data could be worth a lot of money. Of course, this all depends on getting out of here alive. Why are you here? Why work in the middle of nowhere if your skills are so useful? Maybe I've got a bit of the frontier spirit in me. That, and the alternative is a bit too secure for my liking. Ah, so he teeters on the... don't have to worry about security as much, so long as we keep a low profile. Got it. So he's like one of those types of people that like teeters in between both sides, good and bad? Maybe, I don't know. Uh, data. Tell me about the data I'm getting for you. Plans for a few prototype mods? I'm a freelancer. Some of my mods are highly sought after. Good to know. Time to get moving. Just keep in mind what I said. I'm actually happy I came down here. Found, uh, a bunch of people that could definitely use some help. Okay. Back to murdering the Geth. Geth, I'm coming for you. <laughs> Oops. This thing does does dream uh, drive kind of weird though. Oh snap! Oh snap! I'm on fire. No, I'm not. Oh my god! Look at me! I can't even drive. One down. Uh oh. That's not good. Okay, good. I got the rest of them. I was scared for a second. Okay. Who's that? Also, I want to see what's in here.
Nice try there, buddy. Is that all there is? Just... Just one random... Ooh. Metagel. Could always use that. Uh, cryo rounds. I'll take some proton rounds, I suppose. That sounds pretty good. Oh man, I really thought I could hack that. Okay, so there's nothing really in here. But I should probably get back to the uh, Mako, huh? Okay, let's go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, hold on. What's going on right now? Turn around. Oh no! <laughs> this, this thing is terrible. Oh. Oh no! Someone's in extreme danger. I'm on my way. After I secure this air, oh no, he's dead. Nice try. Can I shoot this? I hate how long it takes for them to explode. There's probably like some, something I could level up or something that would make them explode faster. I don't know. Who just shot? Screw your shield, bro. Well, that sounded weird. Oh, this goes further down. Oh, God. Maybe I should stay a little bit more observant. There better be something good in here. Uh, I could always use... Let me get this and see if I can upgrade... Her. Weapon upgrade? I don't know what this is. But it's the highest level, so I'm, I'm taking it. So, let's go to Ashley. She already has medium armor so what does she have scorpion she has mercenary so that let's see what this is that looks way better to be honest and it's stronger all right she's staying with that I guess it wasn't all bad she got an upgrade in her looks now we gotta go save those humans that are apparently pinned down from the Gath attack and uh, my nosiness probably is getting them killed. So I should probably get over there like ASAP, huh? Oh, there goes some more shooting. Why don't I have a... Uh... What is going on? I don't have an aiming thing. Come on. Did I win? Let me get out of here. All clear, Commander. And get back in. There we go. Now I got a reticle. That was weird. That made shooting very difficult. Okay, we got the door. And we got our thing jammed, so that's not good. Where are they? I'm waiting for them. Oh, there they are. Oh god, I missed. What are they up to? There's no point to this unless they're looking for something. Where are they at? All right. I have no idea what's going on right now. Oh, that's this guy's. Oh. What's up, bro? That's all you got? Let me destroy that. That was a pretty well-placed shield. Got him. Is that all of them? 
Thanks, Ashley. I appreciate it for the, uh, the update. Can I not bring my... Nah, I can't. I wouldn't be able to bring it in here, which kind of sucks, but... I think that's one of those medical stations, maybe? Okay. It was absolutely nothing. So yay me, that was just a big block of concrete. Do I have level ups? I do. Uh, let's go with fitness. Oh crap, I wanted to see that. Uh, for her, she only has two. I guess I could... Let's give her more armor. Bigger portion of shield, nice. He's also got two. I want to give him the shotgun treatment, so that's what he's going to get. My guys are pretty strong. We... Actually, you scared the crap out of me, girl. I was about to blast you. I, I don't even know what I was going to say anymore, because she scared me. So that's red. I can't go in there. That leaves the only other option is to go this way. Ain't getting through this with the gear we have. Has to be another way in. That doesn't help. Maybe. Okay, it's got to be this way. Drop, Commander. Yep, and it's too late because I'm already down here. I hear some water. Oh, what is this? Oh god, that scared me. It's Elizabeth. I'm so sorry. I thought you were Geth or one of those Baron. Uh It's okay. You're safe now. But why were you here in the first place? It's my own fault. Everyone else was running and I stayed to back up data. Next thing I knew, the Geth ship latched on and the power went out. I was trapped. I, I tried to get out, but the way was blocked. Huh. Alright, just don't worry. We'll get you out as soon as we find out what the Geth are after. It's not the Geth. It's the energy field they put up. They don't want anyone else getting access to the... To the what? I'm here for the Geth. It's very important I find out what they're after. I don't know for certain, but I'm guessing they're here for the Thorian. What's a Thorian? It's an indigenous life form. Exogeny was studying it. That is interesting. <laughs> interesting. Where is it? What else can you tell me? Do you know where I can find this Thorian? I I might be able to, but not with those geth crawling around everywhere. Look, we need to get out of here, past that field. How? Any suggestions? No, not exactly. But I think the Geth ship is powering it. I've noticed the Geth laying power cables everywhere. You could follow those cables, but there's Geth all over the place. So, uh, tell me about the Geth attack. Why do you think the Geth would be interested in the Thorian? It's just a plant. I don't know why the Geth would care. Exogeny was studying it, but I don't think they found anything special. Personal questions. Tell me about yourself. I'm just a research assistant for Exogeny. I came here with my mother. I don't even know if she made it out alive. She did. I've already met her. She's with some others from the colony. She's safe for now. She's alive? Yep. Oh, thank God. I thought I was the only one left. Absolutely not. Please, Commander, just get that field down so I can see my mother again. Okay, I will, but first tell me about the Thorian. Tell me what you know about the Thorian. I really don't know that much about it. I think it's some kind of plant being. I know it's very old. Thousands of years even. Okay, well, I'll get going. You stay put. I'll go open some doors. Stay put by herself? Yes, take my ID. This should get you past any locked doors. Good luck Ooh. with that field. Oh, snap! Get away! God, I really hope I don't get her killed. I'm like almost tempted to leave either Ashley or this other dude. Rex. 
there with her. She's literally by herself. Hold on, where does this lead to? Nothing. So I guess that one door it is. I wonder what we're gonna find. Also, this Thorian sounds pretty interesting, to say the least. Oh, we got stairs. Stupid machine. What is that? Access encrypted files. What? No, I don't want to review protocol. I am unable to comply. Please contact your supervisor. Damn it! Tell me what I want or I'll blast your virtual ass into actual dust! <laughs> Please contact your supervisor for a level 4 security exemption or make an appointment with... STUPID MACHINE! If there is nothing else, please step aside. There is a queue forming behind you for the use of this console. Oh god. That wasn't very difficult. But why? What was going on? I'm so confused. Exogeny Corporation reminds all staff that the discharging of weapons while on company property is strictly forbidden. Welcome back, research assistant Elizabeth Bainham. What can I do for you? Uh, I don't want to say Elizabeth because I don't want to get him curious. So let's avoid that. We know it's because we have her ID. So I need answers. What information was the last user attempting to access? Fetching data. The previous user was attempting to access details on the study of subject species 37, the Thorian. Go on. Tell me everything you told the Krogan. I was unable to provide the previous user with any relevant data. Aside from lacking proper access, there has been no new data available on Species 37. All sensors monitoring the observation post at Zeus Hope have been inactive for several cycles. What did you just say? What does Zeus Hope have to do with the Thorian? Species 37 is located within the substructure of the Zeus Hope outpost. So this is what Saren wants then? Tell me everything you know about the Thorian. The Thorian is a simple plant life form that exhibits a sentient behavior uncommon with other flora. Through dispersion and the eventual inhalation of spores, it can affect and control other organisms, including humans. The Zoo's Hope Control Group has yielded interesting results. Before sensors went offline, almost 85% of all test subjects were infected. Control Group? Are you saying Exogeny knew its people were getting infected? It was deemed necessary to assess the true potential of Species 37. That's horrible. So that's why they were acting weird. We should warn Joker. Yes, absolutely. Joker. Come in, Joker. Damn it. That field's blocking us. That's not good. We've got to drop that shield and get back to the outpost. I agree. Actually, tell me about the field. VI, what can you tell me about the Geth ship and the field it's generating? I have limited data on the Geth. They have effectively blocked all sensors within the facility. I have detected unusual power fluctuations, but am unable to determine the source. Mm. What do you know about the Geth? What do you know about the Geth? I have no specifics on the Geth as they relate to this facility. All sensors have been purposely decommissioned since their arrival. What do you know about Exogeny? I want to know about Exogeny Corporation. Exogeny Corporation is at the forefront of human expansion in the new galactic economy, funding colonial development and securing resource rights to ensure our progress as a species. Further inquiries regarding company policy may be directed to consumer information services during regular business hours. Okay, so then who runs this facility? Who's in charge here? Who organized the research? All decisions about local resource analysis and acquisition are made by on-site management deferring to the board of directors only when seasonal quotas are missed or exceeded. Huh. Individual employee records are confidential. Uh, what do you know about Elizabeth? Please access my personal files. Oh, we're being so nosy. <laughs> Elizabeth Bainham, research assistant, biomedical division, security level four exemption. You are currently under probation due to disagreements with management over established company policy. These sanctions may be lifted if your next evaluation is more agreeable. Why was I sanctioned? What triggered the probation? 
You were marked as combative about the operations of the Zoo's whole project. Okay, so I like her. the handling of the infected colonists. As a result, you were tasked with monitoring the safety of the colonists for the duration of the observation. Good. I like her. She's going against her own company for the better of people, I, I guess. So, what do you know about the Thorian? Tell me about the Thorian. Species 37 was discovered several weeks ago when a small team was infected with spores while examining ruins near the Zoo's Hope outpost. The outpost was quarantined immediately and study of the infection began. Within 21 days, 58% of colonists exhibited altered behavior. Within 28 days, 85%. So, first of all, how does it control people? Do you know how the creature controls its slaves? The will subversion manifests as intense pain if directives are ignored. The effect is severe enough that subjects are soon conditioned against even minor thoughts of rebellion. Observation suggests the Thorian views its thralls in a utilitarian way. Care is apparently taken to avoid injuring them, much as a craftsman avoids damaging his tools. As long as no action is taken against the creature's objectives, the subjects are free to pantomime a normal existence until specifically tasked with something. Uh, you know, this AI is really giving us a lot of useful information. Where can I find it? Where's the center of this thing? The Thorian is present as a weave of tendrils across much of the lower surface of Pharos. Observation of enslaved subjects suggests there may be key clusters that are tended by thralls. Unfortunately, direct observation of species 37 is limited or non-existent. Uh, how big is it? What's the size of this thing? The Thorian appears to be a diffused creature. Its cognitive abilities are centered in large nerve bundles, but it receives data from kilometers of meandering tendrils. We have discovered bundles approximately one meter in diameter, but these seem insufficient to coordinate the massive sensory potential it possesses. It may simply process such stimulation slowly, or perhaps there is a nerve cluster of a greater magnitude we have not yet encountered. How smart is it? Is it intelligent? Can I reason with it? The Thorian does not exhibit the focused behavior of a predator. The release of spores is an act of survival, not aggression. It does trigger advanced behaviors in the humans it enslaves, but we have yet to discover whether it recognizes or is capable of recognizing humans as more than tools. It is sufficiently alien as to defy classification at this time. Well, this is interesting like crazy. I've already exhausted this part. So, goodbye. That's enough for now. Going to standby mode. Thank you, VI. So, this guy literally gave us a ton of good information about uh about this uh species 37. If it's a plant, can we just burn it? Hold up. Man, that's not what I wanted them to do. All done. Subtle as a boot to the face. How do we cut the power if it's coming from the ship? We need a way to give it a kick. Let's check the other claws. Damn things can't be perfect. Approach. What is this place? Almost looks like the Geth built a church. Hey, if they're looking for God, I'd be happy to speed them on their way. <laughs> I like Ashley. Get down! Oh, that's not what I wanted. Oops. You guys better get out of the way before you blow up. Oh my god, what happened to this guy? Okay, well that now that that's done, oh my description is too low. What is this place? Almost looks like the Geth huh. built themselves some kind of church. Hey, if they're looking for God, I'd be happy to speed them on their way. Yep, you've said that already, Ashley. Uh-oh. What are we gonna find in here? Ah! That was close. Oh, snap, they're right here. Get him! Good job! Is there another one? Oh, there is. 
Absolutely obliterated him. Rex is cool, but I like Garrus better, to be honest. Garrus is one of my favorite companions so far. To be fair, I haven't even used them all. Ah! Hold up. I gotta be careful here. Who's got the cryo rounds? I'm not sure, but it worked. Rex actually is kind of decent. So decryption's too low. There's got to be something in here. What's this? Oh, download data. A few seconds of downloading. You secure Gavin. Okay, that's... I found one of their things. I heard something open. Uh. Okay, maybe not. So then, back it is. I didn't see anything in there, so let me check the map. Just to make sure. So we're... No, there's a transition spot. Hold on, what is this? Oh yeah, that's where we came from. So this is a transition spot, looks like, over here. Let me double check. Oh, just, never mind. Yeah, this is a dead end. So let's see what's up back here. So clearly we have to come back. Can't go in there. Which way did I come from? Hold on, I got I gotta check. Okay, so I came from the other side, so this is the way I need to go. I think. So we're jammed again. That's not a good thing. Okay, nothing. Over there. Oh! Nice try there, buddy. Oh my god. I want this down. They are pretty decent at putting down shields, though. I will say that. What does this thing do? Nothing. They look like ships almost, huh? Decryption's too low. Okay, how do I... Do I go up here? I'm so confused right now. Interesting. So this is also a dead end. Oh no, so I came from that way. Now I gotta go upstairs. Got it, tracking. Just like the other one. You don't have the teeth to tear this out. Keep looking. Uh oh. I don't like the music. Alright. Did they already see me? Come on. Get behind cover, damn it. I'm taking that down. Yikes. Shoot, get it. Dunzo. Who else wants some? What's up, Broski? Is that it? That's all you got? Stay behind cover. Dunzo. You want some too? You guys are cute. You guys really think you guys can compete against Commander Shepard? 
Man, my decryption's too low on everything. Too low. Activate shuttle bay docking doors. Uh, you'll find a repair ticket attached to the console. The damn door to the shuttle bay is f uh, fried again. Works fine if the PSI is 30 or lower. And the safety shutoff kicks in if the PSI gets above 34. So it's got to be between 30 and 34. But if the PSI is in the 31 to 34 zone, the, slur uh, the door slams shut with enough power to shear through a metal beam. I beam. Somebody fix this before one of my team loses an arm. Okay. Uh oh. Oh yeah, that's what's broken. So this is a puzzle, clearly. We gotta get it between 31 and 34. So 5, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. Twenty-two, thirty-three. That's between, right? There we go. Nice. Did it first try. Uh oh. That's not good. That looks like a scorpion almost. See you later, buddy. Doors will be open now. We can go deal with that Thorian thing. Damn. I'd like to have seen the face on their pilot when that thing toppled. This was my kind of mission. Kill a bunch of guests and end things off with a huge crash. <laughs> I repeat, Normandy to shore party. Hey! Anyone there? We got comms Normandy back. Normandy to shore party. Come on, Commander. Talk to me. This is shore party. Is that you, Joker? What's going on over there? We're in lockdown here, Commander. Something happened to the colonists. They're banging on the hull, trying to claw their way inside the ship. They're freaking out. Uh... Yeah, protect the ship at all costs. Keep those colonists away from the Normandy. Gun them down if you have to. Oh, I did no, not... We'll do, Commander. We'll fire off a few warning shots. That should send them running. Okay, thank you for the warning shots, because I don't want them to die. Everyone stay close. This place will be crawling with Geth in a minute. Keep together and we'll get out of here in one piece. Oh man, I answered wrong. I did not. <laughs> I did not want them to be gunned down. Oops. Of course my decryption's too low. Why wouldn't it be? Alright, so we gotta go back, I suppose? It's a long trek, man. I wish there was like some easy way to get back hopefully it's not like I don't get trapped or anything that would suck is this is where the fire was yeah all right so now I go around uh, this way there we go hey Elizabeth we should get out of here. I don't think this place is safe. Uh, first things first. I need some answers. You knew more about the Thorian than you let on. I... I was afraid. I wanted to stop the tests, but they threatened me. Told me I'd be next. When the Geth attacked, I stayed behind to send a message to Colonial Affairs. I tried to tell them where to find the Thorian, but the power cut before I could send the message. I... I, I never meant for this to happen. Where was this? Where's the Thorian? The Thorian is underneath Zeus Hope, but the entrance is blocked. The colonists covered it with the freighter just before the Geth attacked. Uh, I see. But why are the Geth after the Thorian? What could Saren want with it? Well, it does have unique mind control capabilities. Oh, that's a big that's deal. That's was interested in. Normandy to shore party, come in. Yes. What is it, Joker? We're getting a lot of Geth comm shatter. Looks like they're headed your way. Nice job, thank you. Thanks for the heads up, Joker. You heard the man. Let's move out. I'm coming with you. I might be able to help. Ooh, we got four-person party? Create.
Aw, she's all sad now. Wait, hold on, where'd she go? I thought she was coming with us. I'm getting my weapon ready. Can I not go this way? Oh, decryption too low. Okay, maybe I should have uh, invested some points in decryption because it's pretty bad. Alright, so I'm assuming we just get out of here now. Let me through, damn it. Oh, hello. Blast away. They're destroying me. Oh, no, I missed. Got him. That was close. That was a lot of them. I bet you there's gonna be more right up ahead. I'll take care of them though. My shield's charging back up, so we should be fine. But the nope, I was wrong. There's nobody here, looks like. No complaints for me. Oh, come on. Are we? Is there anybody? Is there anyone picking this up? Who is this? What was that all about? I don't know, but it seems like something's here. I really don't like the way this team drives. I swear. Um, where could I have come from? Okay, we'll continue going forward. Maybe it's just up ahead. Oh, that's... That's... Yep. Stop! Stop! They're over! Yeah, I've already met her. I want to see what they say. I want to see what happens. Come on. She's right here. You can't do this, John. Everyone shut up. Uh, let me think. What's going on here? What's going on? You won't get away with this. Get her out of here! Get away from her, you son of a bitch! Oh no, she needs to relax. Damn it! Come, come out where I can see you! All of you! <sighs> Shepard, damn it. I knew it was too much to hope the Geth would kill you. <laughs> I found some interesting facts about you in the Exogenic database. I know what happened on a cruise. This doesn't have to end like that. Explain yourself. What do you think you're doing, John? Communications are back up. Exogeny wants this place purged. This is a human colony, John. You can't just repurpose us. It's not just you. There's something here far more valuable than a few colonists. You're talking about Species 37. You're after the one unique thing Pharos has. The Thorian. The what? It's a telepathic life form living under Zeus Hope. It's taking control of the colonists there. Exogeny knew all along. You won't get away with this, Jong. So you keep saying, but nobody's gonna miss a few colonists. I can't let you do this, man. You've gone way too far. This ends now. If, if that's the way it has to be, heck, come on, uh -oh. come on! Oh! Oh my god! As if we don't have enough problems. Now we're shooting each other in the back. That was definitely in the front. Fault. I knew what was going on and I didn't do anything. That was crazy. Don't you start. You do good work and you know it. So what now, Commander? The Thorian. I need to find out why the Geth are after the Thorian. The colonists won't let you near the Thorian. They die first. They're under its control. Oh my god, that explains a lot actually. Uh, it can be helped? I'm curious about this answer, actually. What else am I supposed to do? There's gotta be another way. I think there is. You could safely use a nerve agent to neutralize the colonists. Like a gas grenade. 
I won't get caught in it too? Releasing clouds of nerve gas doesn't seem like a particularly good idea. It's not like it's weapons grade. The insecticide we use in the grow labs contains trace amounts of tetraclopene, a neuromuscular degenerator. If their nervous systems are already weakened, it may act as a paralyzing agent. Dodgy. But it just might work. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. Sounds good. I'll do what I can. It's better than killing them. Excellent. Thank you so much, Commander. Equip your grenades with the anti-thorian gas upgrade. This will disable infected colonists without killing them. We'll stay out of your way until you Wait, hold on. Is that a part of equipment? Um There's a lot of stuff here. Oh, anti-thorian gas. So is this Hold on, where to go? Grenades. So if I I can't click on this? Do I not have any grenades? Is that why? Oh, upgrades, duh. So anti-thorian gas. So my grenades now have anti-thorian gas, right? So are we good here? Let's see. Please try to avoid hurting the colonists. Use the nerve agent I gave you if you can. Will do. It's almost time, isn't it? Maybe we can free our friends after all. I have to help them. It's my fault this happened. Yep. Don't worry. I'll do whatever I can. And if I can't, I mean, I guess they're I, they're gonna be dead, right? Hold on. Is there? Nah, I think that's just the the doctors. Okay, well let's go back into the Mako and push forward. Luckily they're pretty well defended. Or protected, I should say. All things considering. Oh god. Let's see. Oh yeah, this is where I came from. Oh god. More friends. What's up, bro? That seriously didn't kill him? Shoot him! Oh, come on. I'm horrible at the big bombs. Dunzo. Woo, that was scary. Where's everyone? We really need to push back against the, the Gath, man. Uh-oh, is that a zombie? It is. Resident Evil. Thorian Creeper. Charging up. What the hell was that? I don't know Zombie. what the plant does to people, but that's not human. Uh, we gotta be careful. Leave the colonists. No hitting the colonists. Even if the Thorian makes them fire on us. That's what the gas grenades are for. Oh, Whatever wait. Say, Commander. Let's do it. Was that one of the... What I just killed, was that one of the colonists? I thought it was a zombie. Uh-oh. Here it comes. Come on. Blow up, damn it. Oh my god, this could be bad. Don't kill him. Oh, these are. Oh, these are the colonists. Never mind. Don't hit me. Zigzag. Zigzag. Oh my god, my grenades take forever to blow up. Okay, we did it. 16 still alive. I really hope they're not dead. 
it says 16 colonists alive still, so... Hopefully we're good. Wait, where's the exit? We have to save the colonists. We must. Is this the right way? They could weaponize this very well on a mass scale. This is dangerous tech, man. What were they thinking? Okay. Where is everyone? Hold on, this is where the ship was. We're going the wrong direction, aren't we? Let me see. Map. What is this? Geth transmitter? Okay, let's let's just check. Well, I mean, I guess I can't go that way. I've already been here. So this definitely isn't the way. But I'll check anyways just in case. Where was it that I saw that? Okay, yeah, so this is the right way. Can I even go in there? Yes, I can. Oh, God. See you later, alligator. Oh, snap. I gotta get behind cover. Am I shooting her? Okay, I gotta get out of the way because she's being crazy. Got a flying jellyfish over here. Woo! See you later, Krogan. Get away! My god, these guys are hostile. Ah. They are aggressive. I need to heal. They got my back, I think. Uh, I guess I'll take a grenade upgrade. Do I have to destroy this? There we go. What's up, bro? That's all you got? Aw, oh, that was cute. Rex is over here killing his old people. Come on, Rex. Let's go kick some ass. So that's everything down here, I think. Uh-oh, what's this? Not good. Moving. What's up, bro? Dude, this place is completely surrounded by bad things. There's a lot of ton a ton of stuff here. I'll take I'll take grenade upgrades too, just in case. Sludge container. This is a five. Oh. Uh. The Varen falls dead. Riddles with slugs. This must be the alpha male, the pack leader of these feral sa uh, scavengers. So what does that mean? Here you go. I'll, I'll heal you guys. So that's everything, right? I don't really know where I'm supposed to go. What's this? Oh! Get behind cover, please.
They're everywhere now. Yikes. Dunzo. There's still another one down there. But where is the question? Found him. All right, let's get the flank. Got him. I don't know where I'm going. I'm just kind of winging it, to be honest. Is this where it came from? It's not, huh? Okay, so I think we gotta go backwards. There's another bridge, but that doesn't look like it goes anywhere either. Alright, so I guess back it is. Let me look at the map just in case. Sometimes it tells me things. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything. It was just a bunch of enemies. So that's not where I was supposed to go. It's gotta be back this way. So I already went in there. Hello! Whoa! That shield is not gonna help you there, bruh. Tried warning you. Ooh, he almost blasted me with that sniper rifle. Uh, this way? Where am I supposed to go then? This is all pretty intense. Nothing here, because we're going back to where we came from, I think. Yeah, this is all... Okay, so that's the elevator. Oh, God. Get him! So those are not the... Don't kill him! Don't kill him! I'm really happy they stand still. Got him. So we're on the right track, I think. Oh god. God! Yikes, those guys are... pretty intense. Crap. No! Woo, that was close. Oh no, that's a colonist. I don't have grenades! Uh-oh. How do I do this if I have no grenades? That's not good. Okay, so this is definitely where we have to go, but... So there's two exclamation marks, so I gotta go... I think I just gotta rush it. Run! I don't really have a choice. I probably should have waited for my... Uh-oh. Oh, grenades! Fire in the hole. Let me... Let me get behind cover. Charging. Is it gonna blow up or what? Finally. Okay, that one on the left got taken out too. Got one. Nice. Those are colonists. I'll throw it right there. And then I'll just chill right here. It's a great spot. This is kind of scary because they're like literally... 
Okay. I need you guys to help me with these guys. Get out of my way, Rex. Uh-oh. Done so. So... Why was he on the computer? That's weird. Okay, so far so good. So there's civilians over here, so let's throw it right there. Is that a... That's a colonist too. That didn't... That didn't work. Okay, I gotta get back for a second. Okay, that one's down. It sucks because I'm going to run out of grenades again. Come on. Good. So where are we going? Hey, so that's everything. That's all the colonists? She said clear. Hold on, let me look at the map. Yeah, one exclamation mark is in here, but I can't get in there. So then the other one is somewhere over here, I guess. Oh, it's, it's right there. It's the, the computer, I think. Right to fight it, but it gets in your head. You can't imagine the pain. Oh no. I was supposed to be their leader. These people trusted me. Oh no. Dan. He wants me to stop you, but I won't. No, Dan. Oh no, Dan. No. Oh my god, that's horrible. Lieutenant Dan. Dan the man. Where did he go? I want to see his body. I'm not really sure where he went. Alright, let's check the computer again. Uh, Down here, maybe? Uh, what's this? Uh, where are we going? Why did it have that weird little cutscene? Oh, no. That's the... Okay, we just have to find this thing and put a couple of rounds... Into. We found what the it. Hell is that? That's the plant. That does not look like any plant I've ever seen. This may be problematic. It's huge. Transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Thorian. It commands that you be in awe. I need what Saren came for. You gave something to Saren. Something I need. Saren sought knowledge of those who are gone. 
The old growth listened to flesh for the first time in the long cycle. Trades were made. Then cold ones began killing the flesh that would tend the next cycle. Flesh fairly given. The old growth sees the air you push as lies. It will listen no more. I'm after Saren, though. Give me what I need, and I'll strike back at the one who betrayed you. No more will the Thorian listen to those that scurry. Your lives are short, but have gone on too long. Oh no. There's so many of them. Get out of the way. Is that it? What's up, buddy? Can you, like, stand still? Oh, God. He threw up on- He tried to throw up on me. So this is a wave after wave type thing? No worries. Can I shoot the blister? No. There's gotta be something that we gotta do. Commander, some sort of growth in here. That's disgusting. That hurt it. I can tell. Oh yeah, me too. Okay, so I think I gotta go upstairs. That didn't- he did not like that at all. Oh, dude, there's a ton of them, though. Wait a minute. Did I just see one? Probably not. You can hear him growling and everything. I guess I can't kill him? Another one? She's not happy. Uh... Powering up. Yeah, you can power up, but... I'd rather have you getting offensive. Oh, there she is again. Get away from me. Oh god. Stop throwing up on my people. That kind of reminds me of Resident Evil. See you later, uh, sorry clone. Oh, he's almost dead. Okay. Weapons locker. Uh, decryption too low. Of course it is. Hello. Stop overheating on me. So far so good, I think. Oh god. Right there. Nice. Am I on fire? Oh no! Uh... Unity. Oh no, that's Ashley. What am I doing? Got him. So I learned that Unity trick from a subscriber, actually, who told me that Unity revives my companions. You know who you are, and thank you. That helped. Think we got him, Commander. I think so too. But we still need more legs. Oh, this is not good. Better not. 
not die. Ah! Kill my friends. Is that everybody? Alright, down goes the weasel. Woo, we are on fire here. How many are left? We've got to be down to the last few, right? Come on, die. So I actually took out the clone. That's good. Ah! Aha! Dunzo. Decryption too low? Well, that sucks. Oh no. Oh, this one's. This one's intense. Come on, baby. If it would stop overheating, that'd be great. Did we destroy them all already? Almost. I'm using up all of my stuff. There we go. Oh, I'm stuck. Come on. I need some more medic gel. Get away from me! Hurry up and cool down! You're not gonna throw up on my people. I will probably shoot you though. Cause you guys do love to get in my way. Did it? I think I did it. Maybe. Oh no, wait, this is... I have to be going backwards. So I came from... Here. I'm not entirely sure where I'm supposed to go. Oh! She literally went right into the... To Ashley. That's not good. That's my last one. Oh no. There he goes. Come on. Let's go up there. Okay, there we go. Please tell me that was enough for you to get up. Rex. Oh, there's one more. Two more. Rex. Rex. That's it. Bag him and tag him. There we go. Whew, bag him and tag him it is. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go. It's gotta be this way though. There it is. That's not really doing anything, I need to get closer. There he goes again. He loves to take naps in the middle of a firefight, huh? You know what? Let's use Unity and... Oh, that's not what I meant. I meant that one. Oh, I can only use one at a time. Oh no. Ashley, be careful. How many are there?
Finally! Oh, I did it! Well, he's down. So, I'm assuming she's the real... Asarian, or however you pronounce that. I'm free. Yep, okay. I, I suppose I should thank you for releasing me. Are you okay? Is everything alright? Are you hurt? I am fine. Or, I will be. In time. My name is Shiala. I serve... I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. Dun, dun, dun. Benezia foresaw the influence Saren would have. She joined him to guide him down a gentler path. But Saren is compelling. Benezia lost her way. He tricked her then. Are you saying Saren can control minds? Benezia underestimated Saren, as I did. We came to believe in his cause and his goals. The strength of his influence is troubling. Typical Asari meddling. About time it bit you in the ass. <laughs> uh, this, how is this possible? Asari matriarchs are among the most intelligent and powerful beings in the galaxy. How could one fall under Saren's control? Saren has a vessel. An enormous warship unlike anything I've ever seen. He calls it Sovereign. It can dominate the minds of his followers. They become indoctrinated to Saren's will. The process is subtle. It can take days, weeks, but in the end, it is absolute. I was a willing slave when Saren brought me to this world. He needed my biotics to communicate with the Thorian to learn its secrets. Saren offered me in trade. I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. That's pretty horrible. Saren's pretty quick to betray his own people. He was quick to betray the Thorian, too. After he had what he wanted, he ordered the Geth to destroy all evidence of his existence. Saren knows you are searching for the Conduit. He knows you are following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the Cypher. What does it do? What's the Cypher? And why did Saren need it? The beacon on Eden Prime gave you visions. But the visions are unclear, confusing. They were meant for a Prothean mind. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. He must understand their culture, their history, their very existence. The Thorian was here long before the Protheans built this city. It watched and studied them. When they died, it consumed them. They became a part of it. So the Cypher's knowledge? So the Thorian taught Saren to think like a Prothean. How? The Cypher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. It would be like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, you must have access to endemic ancestral memory. A viewpoint spanning thousands of Prothean generations. I sensed this ancestral memory, the Cypher, when I melded with the Thorian. Our identities merged, our minds intertwined. Such knowledge cannot be taught. It simply exists. Uh, there has to be some way. I need that knowledge to stop Saren. There is a way. I can transfer the knowledge from my mind to yours, as I did with Saren. Try to relax, Commander. Slow, deep breaths. Let go of your physical shell. Reach out to grasp the threads that bind us, one to another. Every well, she looks scary. sends ripples across the galaxy. Every idea must touch another mind to live. Each emotion must mark another's spirit. We are all connected. Every living being united in a single glorious existence. Open yourself to the universe, Commander. Embrace eternity. Whoa. It's another one of those visions.
Why is she looking at me like that? I have given you the cipher, just as it was given to Saren. The ancestral memories of the Protheans are part of you now. Are you all right, Shepard? What'd she do? Uh, I, I, I'm okay. I saw something. It still didn't make any sense. You have been given a great gift. The experience of an entire people. It will take time for your mind to process this information. You look a little queasy. We should get you back to the ship. I'm sorry if you have suffered, but there was no other way. You needed the cipher. In time, it will help you understand the vision from the beacon. Uh... What should I do with you? Now that you're free of the Thorian, what are you planning to do next? If you allow it, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have suffered greatly, and I played a role in their suffering. I would like to make amends. I mean, that's a noble idea. The colonists will need all the help they can get. They'll be happy to have you on their side. Thank you, Commander. May fortune smile upon you. I do believe people can change. You did it. With the Thorian gone, we can start rebuilding for ourselves again. And we're free of Exogeny's threats. We're back to being just a little nowhere colony. Thank nice. you, Commander. Awesome. So let's go back to the ship. The ship's back here, right? Oh, look, there she is right here. I will do what I can to assist the colony in this difficult time. I am ashamed of the damage done to the lives of these people. Uh, what can you tell me about the conduit? Do you know what the conduit is? Or where it is? No, I'm sorry. All I know is that Saren believes the conduit was the key to the Procyon extinction. That can't be good. Whatever it is. You have the cipher. In time, your visions will clear. They will lead you to the conduit. I only pray you find it before Saren does. Uh, the Thorian? Is there anything else you can tell me about the Thorian? When the creature enveloped me, I became part of it. But I still don't truly understand it. So alien, so ancient. Its exact age is impossible to know. It measured time differently. 10,000 years of hibernation broken by a few frantic centuries of activity. Its mind was awesome, magnificent. It transcended all classification. And now it is gone. You sound almost sad. Don't tell me you feel sorry for that thing. The Thorin was a unique life form. A sentient being that lived for 50,000 years, maybe more. There is nothing even remotely like it in the known galaxy. But it's dangerous. I'm grateful you saved me from a life of thraldom. Yet I cannot help but feel some sorrow for the loss of such a rare and remarkable creature. I guess I can understand where she's coming from. So what can you tell me about Saren? What else can you tell me about Saren? There is little I could tell you that you do not already know. He's powerful, he's charismatic, and he is dangerous. I don't know about the charismatic part. I him blind to his true nature. But now I see he's leading the galaxy into an age of darkness and suffering. Tell me about yourself. I want to know more about you. There is nothing remarkable about me. I was merely one of Matriarch Benezia's disciples. For nearly two centuries, I followed her, learning at her feet. When Benezia revealed her plan to join Saren, she gave her disciples a choice. Only those who were willing had to follow her. Many felt her plan was too dangerous. But I believed in her. I thought she could turn Saren away from his insanity. Instead, we joined him in it. Okay, goodbye. Well, Sheila. She's an interesting. I wish you well in your hunt. Thank you. She's an interesting character, I think. Uh, so I think the ship is back here. Yeah, this whole place was insane. Now there's no more combat here. We saved the people. The colony. That was a good... That was. This was a very good area. I liked it a lot, man. It's my favorite area... Or part of the story so far. A lot of action. Combat. Uh, a lot of everything. It was pretty cool. A lot of cool characters. Alright, so where are we going now? I think we have to go to see the journal. 
Sarand is reaching, reaching the conduit to an ancient relic. Uh, Vampire, you received a cele uh, Huh. That might actually... I think this is the one where we haven't done yet, so I think we need to do Vampire and then probably race against time afterwards. So yeah, we should do... Because we've had Vam Vim Vimeyer for a long time, so let's go do that.